Hello YouTube. Um, obviously we're working on a 2011 Easy Go RXV electric cart. Um, I was having some noise from the rear end. Sounds like a creaking sound. Looked on YouTube. Thank you to the guy who uh, videoed him going down the, the yard there with the same noise. Um, in his link he showed that it was um, input shaft bearings actually what was going bad so it's a weird noise uh, it's not like a, a rear end roar or anything it, it's it's a creaking you know almost like your wheels loose so um, called my easy go dealer four days later here we are no phone call from them um, so my process was looked on google um, showed a repair manual for EasyGo RXV electric. Um, showed the input shaft. Um, and so it's something I wanted to show um, and I tackled it. Um, so getting started, I looked on YouTube for electric cart removal, electric motor cart removal. Found it. Thank you to the guys at DIY uh, Cart Garage, I think. Um, got it off and um so we'll go from there I'll, I'll start showing you i wish i'd started sooner but uh just just thought i'd make a quick video this is your input shaft removed so guys when you take your motor off this is sticking out this just goes right in it's a slip fit these bearings are open bearings to stay lubricated um, but this slides, uh, by first thing you'll do is take out your, um, your seal. Took mine out, boogered it up a touch. So not a big deal. Behind the seal is that nice little C-clamp. Um, so that C-clamp sits right there. And then uh, you take that C-clamp off, wrap a piece of leather around that with some vice grips. So like I said, it's a slip fit. It'll come right out. Um, took this down to my local mom and pop hardware uh, auto parts. Timken, they measured it. This is my new seal, but they were Timken bearings. I um, think they were 17 mil shaft um, diameter and they measured them from there. Um, so yeah, had them pressed on, pressed back, uh, pressed off, pressed back on. Uh, total for that, guys, 62 bucks. Those shafts are 129 without a, the bearings online. Um, and then, so I was having trouble finding the bearings. But uh, yeah, the, the local store had it. I'm sure you guys have someone local. Um, if not, I would, you know, then you'd have to revert to your dealer, but um, or get somebody to measure them for you. Um, and I, I'll put the the I'll put the part numbers uh, in the in the description below uh, for the seal and those two bearings. Um, two different size bearings, just so you know. Um, but. Uh, to show you how quick this was, I've got 45 minutes in it, guys. Um, there's your motor removed. Um, six bolts, boom, 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 boom. Three connectors, uh, one, two, and then your electric brake back here. And then there's three bolts here, one, two, three, Easy goes nice enough to number the letter these and color code. So you won't mess that up for you guys who don't want to look up that electric motor removal. But tow mode, take these push pins out. This flips up, lay it out of the way. Get to your three bolts, undo that. The wiring harness runs right here to the motor. And there it is removed. Um, I'm doing the disc service as well. Um, mine was leaking a little bit. 
Um, got that removed. Um, going to reseal that up, new oil. Mine actually tells you what oil they had in it. Um, I know when I looked it up, they were saying mobile, but um, I think it was mobile 40 or whatever, but I'm putting that back in it. Um, also to put grease in it, they say, you know, everybody's taking, take that castle nut off and the, the cotter pin, remove that with a fluid pump, pump it in. But there's a nice cover there that I'm about to pop off and I assume that gives you access to fill that with fluid new gear oil so yeah just wanted to let you guys know how easy this was um and my dealer wouldn't call me back so um like i said uh, 45 minutes removal i'm hoping you know 45 to put it back in together um the tools snap ring pliers vice grips a couple of jack stands a jack a 10 millimeter i think uh, for those bolts so any questions guys let me know um just wanted to try to save you some money and some time um but literally it's, it's not a big deal on these things thanks guys